This illustration deals with uh, rooftop uh, type installations, and it deals with NEC 310.15, B as in boy, 2. And the purpose of the change is uh, table 310.15, B1 and B2 have been relocated from 310.15, B2A and B uh, in the 27 NEC or from the 20. Uh, 17 uh, NEC. Now notice first of all we have uh, in the illustration pointing to the conduit on the roof it's EMT and on the roof uh, it's 100 degrees Fahrenheit is selected from the ASHRAE handbook or we would uh, uh, select 100 uh, well that's the only place you could really get it would be from the ASHRAE uh, handbook is recommended uh, by the NEC to use it. Now, secondly, uh, above the roof, if you're less than seven eighths of an inch by this new code in 310.15b2, you're in the D rate that you see in the calculation of the boxed in information. And you say, nah, you know, uh, uh, if we look at the conduit steel, and you're looking to the left at the top call out, and it says distance above a roof to the bottom of the conduit is less than seven eighths of an inch. The outside amb ambient temperature is 100 degrees Fahrenheit, and if that is the case, it's less than seven eighths, you've got to add on 60 degrees Fahrenheit. And so you add that to 100 degrees Fahrenheit, you come up with 100 and 60 degrees Fahrenheit. And you'd say, man, I just, you know, I can't afford that. I'm, I'm here in Arizona. The temperature is just uh, very hot during the summer. So I'm just going to use XHHW slash 2. And uh, if we see the 310.15B2 exception, it says if you use that, then none of this, it doesn't matter. And a lot of your engineers will use X. HHW slash 2, and they don't get into the derating factors, and most authority has, having jurisdiction recognizes that. Now, so you see in the note, type XHHW slash 2 wire insulation is not subject to this rule of ampacity adjustment for 310.15B2 exception. Now, let's look at it where you're less, and that is the less than seven eighths of an inch from the where the conduit sits on the roof. Now step one, you go to table 110.14C, table 310.16, and a number 10 THWN is 35 amp out there in a wet location. And you know that's considered by 300.9B a wet location. Finding the D rating factor. Table 310.16 and 310.15B1. The outside temperature on the roof, 100 degrees Fahrenheit from the ASHRAE book. The distance above the roof is less than uh, 7 eighths of an inch. So 76 is tacked on and the total would be 160 degrees Fahrenheit. And that 160 degrees Fahrenheit from your table 310.15B1 is 50%. So your conductor just dropped 50% in ampacity. So let's go up to step three. Using the uh, table, we find that 50% of 35 is 17.5. The 10 AWG THN copper conductor is limited to 17.5. So the 7 8 requirements in accordance with 310.15B2 the new ampacity, that number 10 conductor, is 17.5. So that means it could only uh, be put on a 20 amp circuit and the current would be limited, drawn to 17.5 before you load. So uh, can you afford that? You'd say, no, I sure can't. So then just use your XHHW slash 2 and none of this applies. 